Hi, my name is Mara Held. I'm an abstract painter living and working in the Catskill Mountains. Thank you all for joining me in my recently built dream studio. It's surrounded by landscape and the environment helps to inform the work. I work in egg tempera. There's absolutely no light like the light that comes from the life in the egg. Inherent in the paint is the essence of life itself. Egg tempera is an old fashioned, very labor intensive, time consuming process. To prepare a panel to receive paint may take me a month or so of applying many layers of rabbit skin glue and traditional ground. I enjoy the slowness of this process, which uh, allows me to develop a relationship with each panel long before any paint is applied. The paint is made with egg yolk, pigment, lavender oil, walnut oil, and vinegar, which I keep it in this small refrigerator in my studio, along with various snacks and the eggs themselves. When I work, I enter into each painting differently, sometimes with an agenda when I want to investigate something specific. And at other times, I find the painting through a process of uh, basically will and desire. The slowness of the process helps me with this. Some of the paintings are informed by nature and that energy in the natural world. I want the energy and the timber of that world in my work. Being surrounded by mountains and woods, they can't help but enter into the imagery. Other paintings have a sensation or an atmosphere I'm interested in exploring. And in doing so, I use an assortment of uh, disruptive devices to help keep the painting fresh and alive. But sadly, not all ideas are good ideas. And for me, I'm unable to conceptualize or see if an idea in a painting is intriguing until it's executed. Uh, when a painting reveals itself to me as less engaging, I'll have to scrape it down with a single edge razor blade and uh, paint a new painting over it, leaving the ghosted image and the scarring of its predecessor to somehow reveal itself through the new work. For the past decade or so, I've been interested in uh, modern physics and string theory and the ideas surrounding it. It's incredibly mind-blowing. It seems to me that the bridge between ancient thought about our place in the universe is being supported by some of the theories coming out of modern physics. Theories like multiple universes, multiple dimensions, um, and so forth, vibration, yantras, and string theory, uh, a happy triangle. Also, I have to say I have a wanderlust, and I've traveled uh, quite extensively. I've lived in both Highland, Guatemala, and in Italy. I do a body of work when I travel, and only when I travel on paper. And this work is always informed by my location. As I review this wall, I can easily identify where each small painting was done. In my most recent work on paper, I'm investigating this feather shape. Uh, the shape first appeared in a larger work that I'm still grappling with but I thought the shape was the most interesting aspect of that painting. So now I'm investigating that shape more deeply to see how I might handle it. I'm having lots and lots of fun with this. Thank you for joining me. And I am sending a most heartfelt thank you to Fong, John, and all the Brooklyn Rail staff for this opportunity to share my work with you. Wishing you all warmest regards and safety in this most incredible of times.